Uh, right now it is raining up here in Norco, but the long range forecast shows that the Mississippi River could reach flood stage in the New Orleans area by the time it crests in the city later this month. And as you can see, the river level is already high enough for the water to leak through the wooden needles of the Bonnie Carey spillway. And we could just be weeks away from the spillway opening for the first time in two years. A rush of water from the Mississippi River is now seeping through the Bonnie Carey spillway. It could be a sign of things to come as the Army Corps of Engineers is monitoring the height and speed of the river. The forecast projections right now are showing that we could reach the trigger to operate the spillway. So we're keeping an eye on it just like everyone else. The river level at the Carrollton Gauge in New Orleans now stands at 12 and a half feet and rising. The Army Corps generally opens the spillway when the level hits 17 feet and the flow of the river reaches 1.25 million cubic feet per second. The forecast shows we could hit both triggers in the next two to three weeks. The high river is bringing sightseers like Jim and Arlene Crawford to the spillway. I've been fascinated with this spillway for since we've been down here. And uh, I come down all the time, especially when it's getting high like this, to see whether they're going to have to open it. The structure is a safety valve diverting a portion of the river through the spillway into Lake Pontchartrain six miles away. That lowers the height of the river, reducing the likelihood homes in the New Orleans area will flood. Well, after all the flooding that we've seen, just, well, Baton Rouge last year, you know, it's just like, it's good to know we have some protection. The Mississippi River is now expected to crest in New Orleans at flood stage 17 feet at the Carrollton Gauge on March 13th. The Army Corps is ready to open the spillway if needed. It's been around for a while. It might be considered old uh, science and technology, but it's very effective at what it does. And according to the Pontchartrain Levee District, there is now a digging ban in effect for up to 1,500 feet of the Mississippi River here in St. Charles Parish. We should say that the last time the spillway opened was in January and February of 2016. We're live in Norco, Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News.